celebrated swing. Oh, I love Mickey. Mickey who? You know who, the one who drives me batty every spring. If I don't make a hit with him, my heart will break. What's going on, YouTube? It's Ray from Philly here on Saturday night, uh, two days after Thanksgiving. I want to show another huge card that I got in the mail this week that I won from eBay. And this is a biggie. This is, yet again, another card for the 300 great baseball cards of the 20th century by Mr. Mike Payne. Uh, this is my 163rd card of the set. And this is a biggie for me. I'm really uh, excited to add this one because this is an iconic player, a legendary player. Okay, and I got a good deal off of this. Uh, recently, eBay had a 15% coupon, so I was able to uh, take advantage of that. And it's in the new lighthouse holder, and it's of the Mick. 1960 Tops Mickey Mantle All Star PSA 5 in the new lighthouse holder. And it's in excellent condition. There's the back of the card. I will get rid of that glare and give you guys a closer look. This is my fifth Mickey Mantle card. I have the 57 Tops. The 58 Tops All Star, the 62 Tops. I have the 65 Tops uh, Mantles Clutch Homer. Um, and now this, the 60 Tops All Star. So, really thrilled to add that. Um, I'm just moving right along on the 300 Great Card set. It's my 163rd card of the set. So, having a lot of fun doing this set. I love this card. Any Mickey Mantle card is a great investment. So, I highly recommend getting as many mantles as you possibly can. So hold on, I'll flip the phone, give you guys the excerpt from the book, and let's stay tuned. All right, here we are. It's a horizontal card, so I will take it out of the uh, holder. Let me get a different stand here for this to lay it sideways. And there's no creases on this card, no major dings. The cards are fairly sharp. I mean, they're not razor sharp. It's centering is pretty well. Love the new lighthouse holders. And it has the 6-0 in the background behind Mickey. Here's the back of them. Uh, let's see if I can read this here. Mickey has been twice named the American League Most Valuable Player. The first time was in 1956 when he won the home run. The homer run scored RBI and batting crown. The following year he took the honors when he batted 365. In seven World Series, Mickey has hit 11 homers. And I love the cartoon. That slam felt grand. <laughs> in the 53 World Series, Mickey hit a grand slam homer. So just a great card. Love having this card. So let's get a look at um, what Mr. Payne has to say in the book. I think I've done pretty well on these pages. I, I have the Billy Williams and the Ted Williams. This has still eluded me. I haven't found one that I liked. I have the McCovey and Yastrzemski rookies. 60s is an iconic set. A lot of you out there do that set. It's a great set. And it says from Mr. Payne, the 1960 Topps Mickey Mantle, card 563. Uh, by 1960, it wasn't a matter of if Mantle would be an all-star. It was whether he would bat third, fourth, or fifth. He was a guaranteed show no matter how he was playing during the season. This card represents a sort of transition as the 50s were over and the 60s were just starting. And Mickey still had plenty of Mantle-esque thrills ahead of him including another MVP award and another 50-plus home run season. The Mick. So, um, in this set, the 300 great cards, Mickey Mantle's represented the most. No shocker there. I think he has a total of about 18 different cards in this set. I mean, the 51 Bowman's in there, the 52 Tops, the 53 Tops, the 54 Bowman, 55. I mean, there's just on and on. 
there's a lot of Mickey Mantle cards in there, even in the, the kind of like collaborative cards. Um, like he's in the uh, 58 Tops World Series Batting Foes and 68 Tops Manager's Dreams. So he's in a lot of different collaborative cards with her people. So they, that, that gets counted as to how many uh, cards Mickey's represented in there. And I think he has about, from, if I'm not mistaken, about 18 different cards in this uh, set registry for the 300. Putting a perfect fit sleeve on, because you know I got to do that. That's how I roll. All right, there you have it. 163rd card of the set. It's a 1960 Topps All-Star Mickey Mantle in a PSA 5. All right, guys, I appreciate all your likes and comments. Um, I really do. Thank you very much for watching. And make sure you love what you're doing. Talk to you guys real soon. See ya.